Hey, I'm Sarah, and welcome to Readings. If you like the way I read, please like, share, and subscribe. Welcome, new subscribers. Damn, thanks for coming in. Thanks for your love, your light, your comments. Really appreciate it. We're going to the witch, because I want to find something out that I read yesterday. I want to find out what's going on here. I read the cancer. But this cancer reading spoke about your person being very ill. I didn't want to go into it. I didn't want to talk about it. But now today, the spirit says, let's talk about this person. Cancer, if it's not the other side and it's you, God love you, darling. Blessings, love, and light to you and to the other side. So let's go, Cancer. Keep an eye on the time to go and pick up the grandchildren. Cancer, your person. I want to see if I can pick up on this spirit. Oh, well, spirit's very much in the room. Let's go. Let's get her on. Let's get her done. Come on. Answer. The other side. Other side. Decision has to be made on whether somebody wants to be recognized by you again. Truth is, they feel that this is a power couple. Truth is, they feel that this is a soulmate. Truth is, there's been a lot of love here. Like, um, we're not just talking about heart beating love. We're talking about loving. Cancer. The decision's very, very hard to make because... Even though wanting you to recognize them, they very much up in their head about something. Some kind of truth must come out about passion. But in order to bring this truth out about passion, they must first be recognized by you. I don't know if they can come to you. I think they're waiting for you to go to them. Because there's, it's hard to make the decision on whether to go to you or for them to wait for you. I, I don't know. A lot of confusion here. A lot of wrapped up in the head here. We got the devil card with the eight of swords. We got the mind trap. I'm stuck. I'm stuck in my freaking head. But I must be recognized by cancer because there's some kind of truth that I have to talk about, about passion. Got one foot on one path and another foot on the other path, torn in half. Torn in half, I don't know which way to go. Very defensive here. Very defensive. Married person. Married person. Doesn't have to be married. What is marriage to spirit? Two people bonded together at one time. Either married or they were living with somebody. Or they could still be living with somebody. Wanting to hear from you. There's communication. They want communication. They want to talk about something. Somebody has been a real friggin' warlord in this marriage. Someone's been a real biatch or bastardo in this union that they are in. Someone's been a real sourpuss in this marriage. Walls up. Here comes the Bastardo. Bastardo is saying, that there's walls up. He 
healing from love, healing from emotion. Give me a moment, Cancer. Got to listen to spirit. Walls up in this marriage. Someone is a warlord. Someone's a real dictator here. Hold on. Trying to heal from emotion. Walls going up in emotion. I just think that this is a loveless marriage. Other loveless marriage, a loveless union between two people. I, I think they want to talk to you. I think they want to restore. I think there's two people here. Now, what I got is two women, but it doesn't have to be. It doesn't have to be. I mean, two guys. What I got here is trying to heal from emotion and trying to draw the sword out against somebody. Why? It's all wrapped around the home. Walking away from the home. Walking away from home. Walking away from the Ten of Cups. Spirit. Okay. Hold on. I gotta get the blue deck out for a moment. I gotta find out what the hell is going on here. Cancer. Cancer. Your person is living under very strict rules and laws, or they're the one who's strict. Let's give them a cut. Let's find out what's going on. What was really, really freaking good marriage? There's something here. Oh, thank you, Spirit. Thank you, Spirit. <laughs> money money in this marriage money is coming to an end okay so what I'm seeing is the person that's on your mind is ending things on the other side walking away from the ten of cups what is the ten of cups money home Assets, walking away, ending it. But <laughs> you think it's going to be easy for them with the nine here of of clubs, the nine of hammers coming down on top of them after this ending? No, it's not going to be easy. Why? Why, Cancer? Why? Because I think you're releasing. I think you're walking away. So no, just what I'm seeing is somebody is just going to be totally left out the cold on both sides. I think, Cancer, that whoever you were dealing with, I'm obviously not picking up the reading from yesterday, but whoever you were dealing with, with turning the devil upside down again, I got the devil and I got walking away from the devil. With turning the devil upside down, I do believe that may be the warlord, the dictator. It's the person that you loved. Not the spouse, but the person that you loved. I, I think that they believe that if they walk away from wherever they are right now, that they can just take everything with them. There's great loss here. And I also see the possibility of great loss of cancer. Cancer will be walking away too. And it'd be like, oh no, God. I, but hey, you can, only, you, can, you can only be a dictator for so long before karma comes and bites you in the friggin' arse. And what does karma do? It helps you to lower walls. It makes you feel humiliated and humble. Spirit. Whoa. Okay. All right. You 
know this is not going to be someone who's going to be easy to get rid of because once you've lost an entire life on one side and you try to go back to someone else, uh, especially if you made their life hell, what I'm seeing here is the possibility that and the only options that they're seeing is coming to you. You might have a bit of a hard time getting rid of this person, Cancer. This is obviously a whole different reading than what I saw before, what I saw yesterday. But this one... This one not only destroyed what they have with someone else, but now destroyed what they had with you. <laughs> Pisces is here. Aries, Aquarius. Thank you, Spirit. Libra. Pisces, Gemini. There's another Cancer. There's a Taurus. Um, okay, Cancer. Hell of a reading. Mm, I hope you can understand it. Thank you, Spirit. Thanks for joining me. Namaste.